Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com coming at you on a Friday. Happy Friday, everybody. We're doing two boxes of Stadium Club Baseball to start the day off. Random division break number five from jazbeeshobbyland.com. A big thank you to these folks right here for getting into the action. Now, what we're going to do first is we're going to select the boxes. So out of a 16-box case, you can see that I wrote the uh, number of the boxes here. I can count. So right here, we're going to generate two numbers until we get the numbers that we need. Like number 12. Have I done number 12 yet? I have. All right. How about 10? <laughs> I've done 10. We've done a lot of these. Four? 1, 2, 6, 7, 8, 11, 13, 15. We've not done one. Okay, so one will be... See that my little chicken scratch right there? That's one. Let's generate another number. 14, and we've already done 14. We have 13 and 15 left though. 11, have not done 11. So we're doing three chicken scratches right there. One, two, and three, one and 11. We'll save these other boxes for the next break, which is already posted on jazbeeshobbyland.com. All right, now let's go and do some randomizing. We're gonna use one dice roll for both lists. Good luck, everybody. Five and a three, eight times for each list. Names first, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. We got Mary Lou on the pole and in the number six spot. She goes right there, all right. Once again, eight times for the divisions. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. NL Central on top, NL East on the bottom. Now, trades are allowed, but I generally I generally never see trades in a divisional break, but and I don't even know if, if everyone's here. Well, either way, Mary Lou, you have the NL Central. Jay Crider, you have the NL West. John Ryder, AL East. Jay Crider, you got the AL Central. Joe Kroll, last spot mojo, AL West. Mary Lou with the NL East. Let me alphabetize by division. Let's print this out. Any trades? Doesn't look like anyone's talking trades right now. All right, Stadium Club Baseball. We're looking at two on-card autos per box. There's the final printout right there. All right, doesn't look like there's any trade, so let's close up the trade window. Officially in the chat, trade window closed. And let's get this going. Let's get this going. <laughs> so let's struggle there for a second. All right, good luck, everyone. Everything ships in this. And I don't know the, I don't know the parallels the with the different color fonts. I don't know those know those parallels off the top of my head, but everything will ship. And we'll kind of we kind of have a general idea of what the shorter prints are. Looking for two on-card autos per box. It's a really good deal in this divisional, folks. Check it out, jazbeeshobbyland.com. It breaks down to be about um, it breaks down to be about nine dollars a team. Robert McLaugh, Robbie Mack, how are you doing? Good afternoon. Good evening to you. All 
All right, so here is box number one. Let's see, where's my where's my camera angle? If I'm going to hold cards here. I'm going to slide this over a little bit this way. All right. Let's start off with Aaron Nola. Here, let's see if I could adjust the color a little bit here. Yeah, that's a little bit better right there. Good. All right, Aaron Nola leads us off. There's Aaron Judge for the AL East uh, for John Ryder. There you go. I'll set that aside right here. Even those will... Uh... No, I just started. Sorry, Axel. Uh, even that even that uh, base card of Aaron Judge will be will carry some value. So we'll save these uh, black parallels as well. But everything ships in this, so it's pretty solid. I love the the, the photography on this is always really really good. We've been doing well, Robert. Just chugging along, preparing for the national at the end of the month, going to Chicago. I'm sure we'll have all sorts of things happening there. Is this the autograph? It is. Nice, Ryan. What a great shot right there, Ryan Healy, who's having a really solid season too. Nice autograph for the AL West. That'll be Joe Kroll in that last spot mojo. So Joe starting off the day on the right foot. Chris Bryant. And wow, nice Aaron Judge. 22 out of 25. High flying start. Instavision parallel. These aren't very common at all. Out of 25. That's excellent for the AL East and John Ryder. We should look this up and see what this goes for on a secondary market. Let's put that right up there. We'll sleeve those up in just a second. These cards must have been something in the printing process that makes them kind of cling together. Chibber Jones. <laughs> Is that a thousand dollar card right there? Probably. That that Aaron Judge million dollars. I'll bet you that'll cover the break spot easily. That I, I'm almost positive of that. That and the Aaron Judge base card. <laughs> Jose Peraza gold. See, like what a shot right there. That's pretty cool. I wish there were like five by seven versions of these. I would love that. So we're looking for one more autograph. There's Joe Musgrove. And Ryan Schimpf is your other autograph. That's a nice one for the Padres. That'll go the NL West J. Kreider. A great shot. I thought that might have been numbered. It looked like a special parallel, but it's a nice one. We'll still sleeve that one up. There you go. Slide this aside. Great start. Nice Aaron Judge. Nice. 
Robert's been, Mr. McLaughlin has been on eBay buying up 84 tops football, a couple sets, Marino and an Elway. Nice. This is also nice right here. Remember, we got another two box, two boxes of um, of the Stadium Club in the store, jazpieshobbyland.com. A really fun break to do. And I just love seeing um, all the great photography in the in here. So give that a shot. Give it a go. Random team wise, nine bucks a team. Nice. All right. And it's just a quick two box break. We can run this back a number of times tonight. All right, last box. Good luck. Baseball starting back up again today, ladies and gentlemen, after the All Star break. So now it's the stretch run. The dog days of summer of baseball are now upon us. And now we'll start to see hey, are these teams for real? Who's going to keep who's going to keep playing hot? You know, who's going to come out of nowhere to play hot down the stretch? Teams that we th left for dead. Who are the hot teams or the teams that are on top who are going to fade down the stretch? Now is the time. What kind of moves are going to be made? By the uh, by, the end of the month, what kind of moves will be made? Cubs made a move. Jose Quintana added to their pitching staff. Will the Dodgers? Will my Dodgers make any moves? Will the Brew Crew make moves? What do the Yankees need to do? They're fading a little bit. Are the Cubs going to keep pushing back? Are the Astros going to still stay? What kind of moves are the Astros going to make? You know, Rangers might have an outside chance at a wild card spot, but what do they do with guys like you, Darvish? You know, so a lot of questions in the air to whether teams are buyers or sellers. Hey, that's what makes baseball, this this part of the season, so exciting. There's Brad Ziegler to lead us off. There's uh, Real Muto, black foil parallel. Nice Derek Jeter. Sometimes if these have different parallels, foil parallels right there, it'll be they'll be serial numbered. Wow, well, Mike Cody says that judge out of twenty five is up for four hundred and ninety nine dollars. Have have there's a, have there been any that sold on eBay and sold listings? Man, that is crazy. Jose Canseco autograph. So you got Ryan Healy and now you have Jose Canseco on card auto for the AL West. Joe Kroll in that last spot mojo. There he is again, gold foil parallel. See these cards sometimes are clinging together here. Usually they use some kind of a uh, some kind of powder to keep the card sort of slick and easy to move through. Looks like there wasn't enough of that. Nice. Michael House watching the Cardinals Pirates game as he watches Jaspies. There you go. Nice orange Jacob deGrom. These don't come around very often. Nice one for the NL East. Uh, that goes to Mary Lou. Nice, thank you, Rob. Well, it's good, good to see your name come across our desk again. We're looking for one more on-card auto, by the way. Nice Reggie Jackson. And 
David Ross. I thought that might have been the autograph right there now. It's Drew Pomeranz. Is it Tim Anderson? It is. Tim Anderson, AL Central, White Sox. That goes to Jay Kreider with that one. Nice. So there's your second on-card autograph at a stadium club. And unless we see any parallels, that is that, folks. So head over to jazbeeshobbyland.com. Let's get some breaks going tonight. We can do more of the stadium club, which I like. Oh, that's pretty cool. Nice John Lester. 40 out of 50. Scoreless streak, orange. That is uh, for the NL Central. Mary Lou with that one. And there's David Peralta right here. So that's it for this break, folks. JaspiesHobbyland.com Hobby, is the place to be where we can do more Stadium Club Baseball and we can tackle the Spot Randomizer, which will unlock a ton of breaks. So let's get that going as well. This is Joe. That's you. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.